Billions of dollars are on the line as the college football season hangs in the balance. The Big Ten Conference will reportedly vote tomorrow on canceling all games. Other conferences could follow. But the impact of no gopher season wouldn't just be felt on the field. John Lordson shows us what else could be affected. I had season tickets last season, so it was a fun time to go to the games. Last year, the Gophers rode the boat to their most successful season in 50 years. 11 wins and just two losses. But this year, the losses could be felt off the field. Some estimates I've heard that if there's no football season this year, they could lose approximately $60 million. Stephen Ross, a sports management professor at Concordia, says those losses would trickle down to non revenue sports that rely on football to stay in the game. Without football, um, it's a question of what happens with the other sports in the fall. The Big Ten was already preparing to take a hit on ticket sales, but Ross says a potential loss in TV revenue would be felt across the conference. Media rights, sponsorship, and all that that goes along with it is really the, the largest and most significant chunk. Finally, there's a marketing impact to this, not just for the Gophers, but for all schools. Studies show that after a successful football or basketball season, student applications to that university can go up anywhere from 5 to 7 percent. That's one of the reasons I chose to come here in the first place, was I wanted a Big Ten football school. John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. According to the U of M, Gopher football generated more than $9 million in ticket sales alone last year.